Monsanto, producing more, conserving more, improving farmers' lives. That's sustainable agriculture. More at ProduceMoreConserveMore.com. Could bread be the death of the sandwich? Sandwiches are not only a popular lunch option, but they serve our on-the-go lifestyle. And according to the Technomic 2012 Sandwich Consumer Trend Report, sandwich sales are up 4.8% since the year 2010. That amounts to $27.7 billion a year. Now, 49% of sandwiches bought in restaurants or other food service sites are up from 44% in 2010, according to AdAge. Nielsen data shows dollar sales for breads and baked goods during the past three 12-month periods have been on the rise, with the final period ending May 2013 when it reached $23.4 billion. In comparison, unit sales were flat two years ago, down under 1% a year ago, and up a half a percent in the latest 52-week period. So back to my original question. Could bread be the death of the sandwich? Well, we believe the answer could be yes. That's right. Sandwich breads need to change or they could potentially kill the immense popularity of the sandwich. There's one simple reason behind our view. Bread is the single biggest hidden source of sodium in our American diet. The way the bread is constituted today goes against consumers' widespread goal to look fitter and be healthier and benefit from lower blood pressure and less fluid retention. Now, the bread industry is completely capable of reformulating with spices instead of salt or whole wheat wraps instead of rye to enhance flavor, to create favorable mouthfeel and preserve the bread product until it's eaten. Do this, and bread makers could earn a lot of credit and sales. Until then, however, we feel that they're perpetuating older, unhealthy methods that needlessly pump America full of sodium. Now, despite America's huge appetite for the sandwich, we believe the growth could come crumbling down as public awareness of this hidden sodium grows and people commit more to eating more healthily. There's no need to risk this when innovation and better recipes could serve everyone's goal. The Lemper Report uploads right here three times a week with the information you need to stay ahead of the trends. For more, just visit thelemperreport.com.